Uh, here we go. We just finished the flight, uh, having some trouble with the steering. What we did on this one now, if you can see, we're readjusting. Quite a, quite effect. We're going to readjust how we mount the uh, Hamilton Nobias discuits. In this case, what we're doing uh, with the discuits is we have moved them back along the C of G and we're keeping them inner kind of inner close uh, to the body because they move out on this kind of wing a kind of a semi uh, tapered wing with the uh, with the uh, leading edge coming back at an angle you have a very difficult time finding where you need to put those uh, discuits right now it's best to put them on the C of G uh, because if you put them too far back on the wing, they're going to put the nose down and you won't even be able to lift the nose up because they're giving you such a lifting moment. As you can see, we have now made these very adjustable. The airplane flew very well. Uh, having a little trouble, we had to put a different uh, fuel tank on it and the fuel tank keeps cutting out when we get down to a, uh, a little bit because I guess it's at an angle and our, uh, our clunk's not picking up correctly. We need to work on the uh, elevator. We're not getting enough up elevator. Could be, I don't know, the, I suppose, uh, could be the um, servo itself. But right now, let's say this, is that we made a wonderful flight today out here. We made a pretty good flight. Guys with the helicopters over there, I don't know if you can see them. They're making some noise. They're doing good time. But what we did was uh, we made a pretty good flight this morning. Uh, only got one. We had some wheel problem that was uh, very loose, so I had to tighten it up by shimmying some wood in there. But um, this is an exact, uh, this is the airplane after the landing uh, with the Nobias on there. And quite frankly, it was an excellent flight, except for the ele uh, ele ele elevator. Not enough authority on it. I need a little more authority on that elevator. Well, let's see here. We did, we're did. we doing this flight zone, the old what's called Johnson Ranch right now. Ooh, there goes some birds. I wonder if I can pick those up out there. Probably not. But it's absolutely gorgeous out here. Uh, this film, of course, is to uh, reinstate that this configuration is excellent configuration for both lift and we came in really hot and squealed the tires because the engine did cut out and uh, luckily we had enough altitude to get it on back down on the uh, and uh, here we go here comes a bigger one Let's see what he's gonna do there we go maybe I can get him what is he looks like a little Piper PA 28 or something nice little one gonna go right over us yeah, I have to be careful because I these guys are coming from Kestrel and they're coming in pretty low, a couple of hundred feet, and I fly at about 300 feet. Uh, 400 is what uh, you like, what, what FAA would like to see you to fly at. He's going to take on off there. Okay, let's just go ahead and wind it up. One last picture because what we're doing here is solidifying. Uh, we're going to take a side view, a top view, and a front view. That is a very good configuration along the CG. Okay, out, out, out.